Let's talk about Ray syndrome. So a child has a viral illness and you give them an aspirin and then they have acute liver failure and hyperammonemia. That is Ray syndrome. Now what step one loves to ask is what type of failure is this? And you have to know this is a mitochondrial failure. You have impaired fatty acid oxidation. And this is one of those questions that you should just recognize and answer under five seconds. So in Ray syndrome, you have massive hepatocellular injury and you can tell this because the labs are gonna have AST and ALT in the thousands, and you're not really gonna have tons of bilirubin elevation, and the liver failure is gonna come from the mitochondrial dysfunction, not cholestasis. Other things on your diagnosis are gonna be like viral hepatitis, but bilirubin is usually gonna be clearly elevated in viral hepatitis. And then obstructive and cholestatic diseases, well there the bilirubin and the ALP are both gonna be high. But here the AST, ALT, whoa, that is super sky high, but the bilirubin is pretty normal, maybe on the, like, the higher end, but it's gonna be normal, and ALP is only mildly elevated. And so that pattern is gonna be Reyes syndrome. If you found this helpful, be sure to like and subscribe.